gamers are playing to win. This is why you need to have a mouse that affords to go with high speed. If you watch the way a pro FPS gamer plays, they're using a very low sensitivity, which requires them to use very large movements and move the mouse really fast in order to hit their targets. When an optical sensor fails due to excessive speed, it can cause you to look up at the sky and it can cause you to miss targets or even worse. The new mouse G402 Hyperion Fury is a specific device to go fast. To go faster than what a human arm can do. Logitech has made a different approach. We come to the conclusion that combining different sensor technology together will permit to reach a level of speed that nobody could reach before. In the Fusion Engine, we use an accelerometer and a gyro to augment the capabilities of the optical sensor. If the optical sensor fails due to moving too fast, it's generally less than a tenth of a second. A tenth of a second is a huge amount of time when you're gaming. So we want to always be providing data to the system so that you never have a situation where you're going to miss your target because you're moving too fast. The goal here was to replicate the movement of the gamer's arm doing a fast swipe over his surface. This current device here is featuring the full electronic that is in our Hyperion Fury G402 mouse and we have to launch the test like this. And the arm is moving at a pretty fast speed, so this kind of setup permits us to validate that the sensor technology we put in Hyperion 3 is matching our expectation. It's a speed bullet, it's a sports uh, car. The user has only to concentrate on his playing style, and he can blame anymore his mouth. 